Hi everyone, it's Blessed to be here and it is, <laughs> sorry there's like stuff in my eye. Yeah, it's early morning so I wanted to just show you guys like what I do in the morning when I wake up and how I get my hair the way that I get it. Um, not that my hair, when you see it, it's anything special but um, it does take a couple of steps for me to get my nice picked out afro and make sure it's soft and make sure my hair is moisturized for the day so um, we'll start by... <laughs> I haven't uh, done anything to my hair yet, so I'm going to take my um, satin cap off, and this is what I wake up looking like. So <laughs> It's funny to be on camera like this. It's kind of embarrassing, but this is it. Um, my hair is like all random and not big, but my hair is pretty soft, and uh, I think just because of what I do to my hair in the morning makes it um, soft. <clears throat> soft throughout the day and then when I sleep it still stays moisturized so first what I do is I grab my pick and I start picking and a lot of you are like why are you picking your hair with that small pick in the morning shouldn't your hair be hard to get through and like I said my hair is pretty I mean it's not not that um, rough it's still kind of soft and so I don't care how many people may think this is bad I do pick it um, kind of I'm picking it dry but like I said it really is kind of like soft it's, it's taking only a little bit of effort for this pick to go through and if you look right here there's only a little bit of hair coming out so it's not like I'm pulling out my hair so I do kind of just like and I know some parts are tough that's why I'm like kind of lightly picking it so I just see how easily my hair can pass through and in the back it's not passing through so well so Okay, so see, yeah, I've lost some hair, but not much, and you do shed hair daily, so. Anyway, um, so what I do next is I take my mixture here, and no, it's not water. It is actually, um, here, I'll show you what it is. This right here is my vegetable glycerin and good old water <laughs> and peppermint oil for scent. So I take the vegetable glycerin water peppermint oil mixture. And I just spray it all over my head. And as you can see, my hair is like pretty much already like a big old afro. I, since I trimmed my hair not too long ago, um, I have the video up. My hair just seems so much softer. I don't have to do that many steps in the morning, but I just put a good amount of this vegetable glycerin in. Just kind of rub it around. And now, because uh, you know this is a humectant, a vegetable glycerin. And it's winter time, so <laughs> there's not too much moisture for it to draw from the air. But it's still actually, so far here in Minnesota, it's snowed, it's been cold and rainy, and my hair still is very soft and loves this vegetable glycerin, so I haven't changed my routine at all. So now with that vegetable glycerin in, and my hair is, you know, sort of wet, it has the glycerin in it, it is even more so easier for this pick to go through, like I'm barely making an effort now and this pick is going through nicely so yep so this is what I do in the morning pick 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 and now it's just the back's easy to pick through as you can see it looks like my hair is getting bigger when you first saw it when I woke up it was kind of stuck to my hair just feels like it shrinks at night it doesn't it just you know it's just sucked up the moisture <laughs> while I was slumbering I'm careful in the front because as you guys know I'm trying to regrow my thin edges so my edges are still not where I want them to be, but I'm not bald, so that's what I care about. <laughs> it's not being bald. So the vegetable glycerin is in there nicely. Look, it looks like my hair grew. All right. It kind of, the vegetable glycerin expands my hair. So um, what I do next is I take this right here, and there's not much left, but this is pretty much, this is going to do me for today because you don't have to use much. What's in here is a mixture of, let's see. Shea Olean, which is liquid shea butter. I love this stuff because you don't have to like melt regular shea butter in the microwave or whatever. It's just liquid. Shea butter in its liquid form, um, safflower oil, and jojoba oil. So, and a little bit of peppermint to scent. So, once again, this right here that I'm going to put in my hair is liquid shea butter, peppermint oil, safflower oil, and jojoba oil that I just mix in peppermint to scent. 
and I'm going to squirt some of this in my hands. It's runny, so I can't really, my hands are all greased up, but this is what it looks like. And I just rub this throughout my hair. And I know, um, I mean, we have a, um, Afro kinky textured hair people do have lots of hair and it's very thick. So you're probably wondering, is her hair even getting penetrated? Because I'm just putting everything on top, but it does. I mean, I kind of rub it, but but my hair, I do this every day, so <laughs> it gets its oils in. So my ends just look so frizzy. I've even trimmed and I guess it's just for the moment, that's how my ends are going to look and I'm fine with it. So, okay, I got that in. Um, I think I'm going to put a little more. I mean, this makes my hair shine and it's not harming it in any way. So I'm not like putting it all over my scalp. It's going on my hair. Sometimes it's not good to put too much oil on your scalp. And I'm not really oiling my scalp. I'm just getting it all over my hair. And yes, my hair looks kind of choppy, but once I pick it out, it's going to look really nice. In my opinion, really nice. Not everyone likes the fro look, but I love the fro look. I, I just love how I... Ooh. <laughs> I don't think. I love how a big fro just shows my length. So, with that oil in, I just go ahead and pick my head. No, I know it's making all kinds of noises, but it's not hurting me. <laughs> I'm not in pain or anything. Okay, so I'm going to end this video soon. Um, so that's what I do. Pick it out until, you know, the thing cut, until the pick passes through easily. Once the pick passes through each section easily, then I know I've done good and everything's added and I have enough oil and everything else in my hair, so... And I don't make it fancy, I just, the pick pass through my hair easily, I'm done. So what I do now is because I'm, after this I'm getting in the shower, I take my shower cap. Yeah, this one's getting old and I have like a little rip in it, but whatever, for the time being it works. I put my shower cap on. And then I'm going to hop in the shower and I do this all before the shower because my body heat's going to, you know, activate all the stuff I put in my hair. It's going to kind of heat up the glycerin. It's going to be like my in this cap is going to be heated and it kind of like brings all the ingredients together, the glycerin, it brings the oil together and it just makes my hair even more moisturized. Like when I get out of the shower and take this cap off, my hair is going to be so soft. It's already soft, but it's going to be even more so soft because more heat's added from the my body heat from the shower. So I will come back after this and um, when I'm done getting ready for the day, I will let you guys see what my hair looks like. It's just going to be my usual afro, but you can see how I woke up with my hair matted and stuck to my hair and how I finish with the big afro. So I'll be back and show you guys what my hair looks like. Okay, so here's the finish me. Um, after I got into the shower, I picked my hair out for one last time and I added this aloe vera 100% um, gel to my edges and kind of like brush them back a little bit. I love this stuff because it doesn't leave my edges hard. It just gives it a little, a little, a little slick. So um, I am on my way out of the door. Um, I put a little makeup on. I keep things minimal, so just a little um, mineral makeup, uh, eyeliner, and just some lipstick, and put on my 70s type shirt. <laughs> and today is my birthday. I am 26 today. Yay! Yay for getting older. I'm glad I lived another year, so happy for that. Um, my boyfriend's taking me out, so yeah, that's all for today. Um, look at the pictures at the end because I'm going to let you see my hair up close. Nothing special, just a fro, but you can see how big and full it is compared to when you first saw it this morning. Okay, bye guys.